I'm the cringe critic. I react to it, so you don't have to. I am back because there's cringe to react to and loyal followers to help save from cringe. I have my send memes hat. I don't have my fucking my my fucking necktie and my dress shirt, but we'll make do with what we have. And today's cringe tastic story is beyond the Taz. Taz beyond X Reader. Wait a minute. Taz Watt's YouTube channel is named Taz Watt, and his Twitch channel is called Taz Beyond. He doesn't have that many so fo fucking followers. What the fuck? Whatever. It was the middle of the day, and you found yourself in your favorite coffee shop. That is not Timmy's, how dare you. <laughs> Where you sit at your usual table. But something was different about today. There, standing across the room, was a very tall, very attractive male <laughs> species ordering a... What other fuck non-Canadians not ordering our goddamn Timmy's gets? You find yourself staring at a beautiful stranger long, longer than you know you should be, until he starts heading to your direction as one direction, what makes you beautiful, softly starts playing in the background. You panic and act like you're reading a book, even though you don't have a book with you, and all you have is a half-eaten cookie, a napkin, and a coffee that isn't Timmy's coffee sweat sucks. The stranger comes up to your table, no words for a moment, but then a sexy, deep voice, but one word that was actually four, because I'm a sexist. Is this seat... Is this seat... Is this seat taken? <laughs> my voice isn't that deep. Taz's voice isn't that deep, but not Taz. You look from your book, nervously, and shake your head as the handsome, honk stranger sits down. You both sit in science for a while, but but this is anime physics, so a long while for you to use will lose just five seconds to everyone else. My name is Taz Beyond, and I hope you don't mind me sitting here. All the other seats are taken, explaining that sexy deep voice of his that made you swoon, even though the entire coffee shop, shop was empty. Show, you fucking idiots, you can't smell right. It was empty other than a few workers and an old guy that had been there since you got there two hours ago, and you're pretty sure he might have stopped breathing. Uh, um, it's totally fine. I don't mind at all. Uh, my name is... I'm going to do this. Ah, uh, yes, my name is... Insert name here. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. I don't mind... Oh, I'll, I'll, I, I fucking had a brain fart. My name is... Insert your name here. By the way... He said in a small, timid voice, clearly either just to try and make yourself seem like a damsel in distress, or just so you can try and stop being horny as fuck. Either way, I think it's working. I don't. <laughs> Insert name here. That's such a nice name. I just have a cat named. Insert your name here. That cat, that cat was named after my grandmother <laughs> until they both died. His works, you can't fucking spell right. It's words, you dumb fuck. His words, his works were a little weird, but you didn't care. You are so, you are too enamored, too, as in too there, not too as in also, you fucking dumb fuck. God, I hate the shit. Alright. <laughs> and by, by with complex and the sound of his voice, you wouldn't help you, but ignore him completely and let the animal urges within you take hold as you thrusted yourself over the table. And started onto him and started making out with him on the cold hot floor. God damn it, hey Recky, there, hey Recky, there's some hosers over there fucking on the floor. Again, said a very short, very soulless worker from behind the counter. Are you fucking kidding me? Again, Tyler, if them hosers make a mess, I'm not cleaning up this time. Said a scruffy and handsome, and totally not me. Guy that was popping his head out from the back prep area. Hey, Taz, your hoser, stop fucking on the floor. Shoot the very short workers that kept bonking your newly found love on the head with the broom. You decide to get up off him, seeming as you only... You're... You're... You are not fucking you're as the possessive, you fucking idiots. What fucking time is it? It's 12 o'clock. I can't drink. No! Where the fuck were we? As you're not only making a huge fool out of yourself in front of these very attractive people, but you notice that Taz has not yet gotten off the floor, but when you look at him, your body freezes and another sponge of as a scream because you knew you... Your newfound love Taz beyond has been bonked on the head by that soulless shorty as so hardy turned into a cabbage. 
the end. God, I hope so. Well, that was, what the fuck was this called? T Beyond the Taz, Taz Beyond Next Reader. I can only, I can only imagine that they're going to make a sequel. Well, I've been the, I almost said that, I've, I've been the Cringe Craig. I react to it so you don't have to.